How's it going out there? This is Feed Your Minus. So Rand Paul recently has slammed NASA for wasting taxpayers' money with this moon landing investigation. And it's not the investigation you think. It's it, it was an investigation into what Neil Armstrong said when he landed on the moon. So they had this massive inflated budget, spent all this time and effort to review all the tapes, the audio tapes, and try to determine what exactly did Neil say when he allegedly landed on the moon? Like they wanted to determine, did he say this is one small leap for man? Or did he say this is one small leap for a man in a giant leap for mankind? You know, whatever, some stupid, you know, some. It was just like pointless, basically, what they were spending this money on. So Rand Paul was criticizing this and saying, so. This science agency had requested this budget just to and, and spent this much time on a project just to, to hear all the audio tapes to try to figure out what exactly was said on the moon. And he was saying, this is a big waste of taxpayer money. And that's true. But you know what also is true is NASA itself is a big waste of taxpayer money. Um, if people realize that the outer space is not what we were told and all these space agencies are manipulating our minds, you know, that's what the real waste of money is. It's the, it's the space agency itself, not just this small piece of the pie where they were wasting a budget on this frivolous um, inquisition. No, the big waste of money is NASA itself and all the space agencies, the mind control agencies, basically, um, here to control our minds and and uh, insist that outer space is real. And why would they do that? Well, I explained that before, but um, it's all about controlling us to not know who we are and what we are here on Earth what earth is um they're hiding proof of god proof of creation proof of that you know humanity is way more powerful than what we were told um they're hiding a lot of um a lot of things by having us you know it, it just pretty much space in outer space uh gives credit to the big bang theory and the scientists are just they, they come up with the this um mind control program in order to convince a lot of the population that science is real and uh well not really just science but they're trying to um suggest that the big bang is the only um actual uh, truth out there they want that's why so many people believe in the big bang because science says so and with outer space they really don't question what they could be questioning so um yeah the the space agency itself is the biggest waste of money so Rand paul it almost seems like he i wonder if he's kind of on to on to them or something like the way he because he would this um so I'll, I'll leave a link to his presentation in the comment section in the description box because he wasn't just going against nasa he was he was going against a lot of science because in his presentation he had like several you know, um, examples of how science is wasting taxpayer money with frivolous inquisitions into non-accessional um, inquisitions about topics that are just not beneficial to anybody. Um, it's just basically a money grab, he's saying, like, all of these so-called programs are to um, justify their budget requests because kind of how a lot of these agencies work is they get a certain budget every year an annual budget and including nasa they get like what 20 billion a year so all these agencies just get all this money and they have to make it they have to have evidence of them using the money on stuff so they come up with all these frivolous and um just ridiculous uh science projects just to and he shows you all the examples. I'll leave the link in the comment section in the description box so you can check it out. I mean, it was just, I was, um, when he brought up the NASA thing and the moon landing, I was like, oh, wow. Like, 
I was just kind of skimming through it. Then I saw the NASA, uh, the moon landing picture. I was like, oh, wow, is he is he actually uh, figuring this out? And then I, I listened to it, and yeah, he was just talk. He was focused on just that one particular um, area of um, finance. Um, but really, I was just wondering, like, does Rand Paul know more about, you know, that he, he just didn't want to go there, you know? Because he can't really go there, because Rand Paul has been really speaking up on a lot of issues, even in that video. Like he's he he knows science. He's kind of on the science. It looks like he's on the science in their religious cult. You know they they're they're um, taking over the minds of a lot of people. Um, he's saying like, well, he he was basically saying they're wasting taxpayer money with frivolous um programs. So, but it, it's almost like he knows more about like science than and and how they are um. You know they're 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 kind of fraudulent. You know, um, yeah, they're not like they're not really um, on the up and up. So with a lot of programs, I mean, you'll have to check out the video for yourself. Also, I'll leave a link to um, my playlist about space agencies, so you can check that out too um, and see for yourself how these space agencies operate to control your mind and so science too i mean science is um there's evidence a lot of evidence that science is trying to control your mind and take your money and um yeah they're just trying to inflate their budgets and sh they want you know when it's time to show what did you uh need this money for they they can say hey well we did this program and this this program and nobody questions them like, oh the, and then you look into these programs and they're ridiculous subjects that they're wasting all this money on and then uh they can say hey well i guess we need at least this much money or more next year you know so we can continue uh our research and then nobody's looking into the research though that's the thing but Rand paul's on to them so um he might even know more than what he's saying um and that's interesting like i said that he brought up nasa i mean that's just like that's like bingo um nasa is uh, all that money every year we don't need to be giving them i mean we're giving them money to basically um manipulate our minds and program our minds into a false um false universal perception of the solar system and all that stuff and um just they're trying to convince us that this is what it is this is where we live and no, you know nobody's questioning them. So, uh, I mean, I don't, I don't know. Maybe if if more people get into the system, like regular people, I mean, there is a chance that you, you know people can get in there and really start. Like like even Dean Odle, like he he's a um, flat earther and he's running for uh, governor. So I think it's of Alabama or something somewhere. Arizona might be, I don't know, but he's, um, yeah, if, if you get people, regular people in office, I mean, you can begin to, um, uncover, we can, you know, these regular people get elected to positions and they can, can, they can really start to speak up, you know, and if, I mean, who knows, who knows if that's possible, it probably is, I mean, Th that's how they got in they they get all their people in they're real organized about it with all their uh, secret programs and fraternities and you know they know how to get their people in the system so if if um if regular people start getting in the system too though i mean that kind of evens the evens the um playing field doesn't it so yeah uh more the more citizens that, that actually apply for these positions and get in i mean they can really begin to uncover and um, a lot of information to start questioning uh, these scientists and these agents, space agencies and everything on a national platform. So, yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. All links will be in the comment section in the description box. I also leave links to my other channels and my social media. And if you want to donate to the channel, you can donate as little as a dollar to help keep things going here at Feed Your Mind. Thank you for your support. Thank you to all the patrons out there. This has been Feed Your Mind signing off.